from Washington. Thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President, I'm here today with a very simple bill to protect doctors who are providing legal care against attacks from extreme, out-of-state, out-of-touch politicians. In my state, abortion is not only legal, but protected by our state constitution. But when I talk to abortion providers in Spokane, where they see a lot of patients fleeing restrictive abortion bans from states like Idaho, they are terrified that they could face a lawsuit that will threaten their practice and their livelihood just for doing their jobs, just for providing care their patients need, care that is once again completely legal in my state. We're talking about people who are following the law and simply want to provide care to their patients. This should be cut and dried. So Mr. President, as if in legislative session and notwithstanding Rule 22, I ask unanimous consent that the Judiciary Committee be discharged from further consideration of S-1297, the Let Doctors Provide Reproductive Health Care Act, and the Senate proceed to its immediate consideration, and further that the bill be considered read a third time and passed, and the motion to reconsider be considered made and laid upon the table. I object. Mr. President. The objection is heard. Senator from Washington. So, Mr. President, let's be clear. Republicans who are now in the middle of trying to rewrite history and claim they only want state politicians over willing women, already in extreme position, by the way, just made clear that actually, on second thought, they have no problem whatsoever with politicians targeting doctors in states like mine where abortion is legal. I think that pretty much gives the game away. I yield the floor.